A summer problem could get a lot worse. Yeah, we're talking about mosquitoes here, and we've already had a local man contract West Nile virus. And as WLWT News Flash Jennifer Shack reports tonight, a change in the weather could create the perfect conditions for mosquitoes to breed. In greater Cincinnati, mosquitoes are a common problem every year. But you may be surprised what this rainy summer means for the population this year. The first human case of West Nile virus this year in Cincinnati was in late July in St. Bernard. Despite that, we've likely had fewer mosquitoes in the region this summer. Susan Galvin and her husband like to bike ride in the evening. They wear bug repellent and take mosquitoes very seriously. I have noticed it's not as bad as it usually is. Part of the reason is probably the rainy summer. Mosquitoes reproduce in stagnant water. Incubation takes between 2 and 15 days. Here in Cincinnati, between June 15th and July 31st, our longest stretch of dry days was only four. So we've had plenty of water for them to breed in, but they haven't had enough time to do so. What that rain does is it flushes out all the stagnant pools of water. So we really haven't seen an increase yet in the mosquitoes. The Hamilton County Health Department traps and tests mosquitoes for West Nile virus. So far, no positive results this summer. Although it's been a quiet start to the season, that could be changing soon. It's usually between now and the first frost is when we see the virus kind of proliferate in the mosquito population. And then if we have a bigger population, there could be a greater chance or a bigger chance that you might get uh, West Nile virus, even though it's a very slim chance. So get outside while you can. The upcoming stretch of dry weather in the next week will likely increase the mosquito population very soon. The West Nile virus is considered indigenous here in greater Cincinnati, so it's going to be here every summer. It becomes a problem with an outbreak when we have a high population of mosquitoes as well as a lack in prevention. In St. Bernard, Jennifer Shack, WLWT News 5. We also spoke with the Cincinnati Health Department today. They have not trapped any infected mosquitoes so far this summer, but if you are bitten by an infected mosquito, only 20% of you will experience symptoms. There's no way to know in advance if you will develop an illness if you are infected. A